I want to hear old Jimmy skin the blues again. Hello YouTube and welcome back to Multi-Tool School. This is a product from Tool Logic called the SL Pliers. And it is a folding blade knife with a partially serrated blade. It's a really good sharp blade. And of course it has a liner lock right here. And it comes with this pocket clip. So it initially looks like a typical folding blade knife. It also has pliers and you get to them a little bit differently than what you might be used to on a multi-tool. Say for example this uh, Leatherman Skeletool, the plier head is right here in the middle on the inside and the handles both fold out like this. Well, on the Tool logic, you access the pliers like this. This handle folds up and like so. Now you have your pliers. Now these pliers are not as big as the pliers that come on uh, something like the Skeletool. But they are spring-loaded right here. So you have the uh, spring action. So I like these pliers. Uh, and I like this multi-tool. In addition to the knife blade and the pliers, you also get a bit driver, which is located right here on the end of this handle. And this bit driver is going to be a smaller bit um, it's not your standard quarter size uh, or uh, uh, one fourth inch size bit. This is a four millimeter sized bit. Now this uh, has a Phillips on one end and a flat head screwdriver on the other end. And there's an extra bit in the handle right here that's held in place by friction. Now these uh, four millimeter size bits uh, just happen to be the same size as what you get on the Victor Knox Cyber Tool. So uh, if you have a cyber tool or have access to four millimeter bits, you can swap them out on this tool logic. Here's a Torx, I believe, that uh, is going to work just fine in this uh, bit driver on the tool logic multi tool. One thing that uh, I noticed is that this tool logic is a lot like the Leatherman Skeletool. These uh, are shaped a lot alike. As you can see, they're about the same 
size. Uh, each one has a nice pocket clip. Uh, they're one hand opening blades. Like so. As a matter of fact, uh, each one of them has a partially serrated blade. As you can see here. Uh, each one of them has a bit driver, as I showed you. Now the bit driver on the Skeletool uses the Leatherman flat-sided bits that only work on these Leatherman tools that use that flat bit. And here's an extra bit uh, in this uh, slot in the handle here, so you can carry an extra bit with the Skeletool. One thing that I have mentioned previously uh, that might be uh, possibly be of concern to some users, with the Skeletool, when you deploy the blade, the liner lock is right here, and when you grip this tool, if you happen to grip it like this or like this, you could depress that liner lock and possibly release the blade and have it come down on you. You don't have that problem with the tool logic. The liner lock doesn't protrude and when you grab hold of this, you're not going to be grabbing the liner lock or depressing the liner lock just by gripping the, the knife. To release it, you're going to have to kind of get your finger down in here and push it over to the side like that. So, I think uh, uh, there's some interesting similarities between these two and some interesting differences. There's also a, a fairly significant price difference between the two items. The Tool Logic SL pliers. I like them and I've been carrying it for a while and I intend to continue carrying it. Thanks for watching. That's all for now and we'll see you next time.